Any time the opposition wins, it is justice. But when the ruling party wins, it is injustice. Kenya Mo Festus. Welcome to the news and please subscribe to our channel to get notified when we post hot juicy news update. Please click on the notification bell. According to Kenya Mo, the Minister of State of Labor and Employment has lamented the way on which people are of the opinion that is always injustice whenever the ruling party wins in an election. Festus Kanyama, who is also the spokesperson for the ruling All Progressives Congress APC Presidential Campaign Council, noted that when it stares towards the opposition and they win in any of the election, such is always seen as injustice to the people. The APC PCC, who made the statement on a verified social media handle, pointed out that such become the, became the norm, whether in the field or in the court, adding that it could be seen as a hypocritical act. And as what, any time the position wins, whether on the field or on the court, it is justice. Any time the ruling party wins, whether on the field or on the court, it is injustice. His statement is, however, coming shortly after Ainek had declared a matter of injury under the People's Democratic Party, PDP, as the winner of the Adama governorship election after the coalition was suspended following the announcement of the All Progressive Congress governor candidate, Aisha Binani, as the governor elect earlier. On the REC, earlier on by the REC in the state. First, the Scanima post on Twitter with us. Anytime the opposition wins, whether on the field or in the court, it is justice. Anytime the ruling party wins, whether on the field or in the court, it is injustice. Hypocrites with double standards everywhere. Now, whose fault is it? I keep telling people. The All Progressive Congress came out and said they will win the election. They did not campaign for people to vote for it. I never heard. Please, I stand. You can bring out where they said, vote for us. Let me see. It was always, we are going to win. And I was like, ah, what's, the, what's giving these people this confidence? What's in the same way they make these people, they lose. And the thing is, even if they wanted to rig it, that alone, I was like, <laughs> these people... Their level of confidence in coming out to say, hey, they'll win the election. Something fishy is going on. Something fishy. And if you check them, indeed, something fishy. Had it been that after you have come out to say this now, they check it and now Isha Binani, you know, truly won the election. People will say, okay. But for the fact that you said this now, they want to check it. That see, will make them check whether or not truly, truly, she win this uh, Election, I kid you not, she know we not free and fair. She was rigged in. I'm telling you, and I see you stuck. I'm not, and I first just came out. I see you stuck. I'm not saying it. I saw it day, day pure. Because you cannot tell me, you cannot come out to tell me that a uh, 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 what's it called? Your own party will win without rigging. APC failed in many areas. I keep saying that as of 2021, people, if you go to ask them what you're voting for, they will tell you PDP. Because they were still thinking they will still bring out any of the lesser evil. Boya is it the devil or is it deep blue sea or the deep red sea? They don't know. But they shall know that they're not going back to APC. So for you to come out and say, eh, it's if the opposition win, that it is, it is eh, what's it called? It is justice. But if the ruling party wins, it's injustice. It is because that is what you people do. There is not a matter. This one is a matter of hypocrites. That is what. That is a trademark. Anywhere. And it is. Look at what happened in the presidential election. Did you see what happened? Now, because the government was quiet about it. What happened? There was a repeat of, on the, the repeat of the issue in Adamawa. There was a repeat of that particular issue in Adamawa. And you're coming out to say, if the opposition wins, it is a justice and when the opposition they lose or when the ruling party wins okay now so it be as you stock them now so it just be no jokes no you can't you don't need to add you don't need to subtract had it been the all progressive congress had it been the apc they came in and they performed well ah uh -uh. ha in short people who want to sleep they will not come and say anything whether they win the one or not for goodness sake, 
<laughs> the economy sector is is, is 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 it has been they don't milk and dry. In fact, they don't you know why they don't milk something, the water don't finish. Everything don't finish now blood as in the person don't they bleed out. Now in the economy day. The health sector uncle, that one has collapsed. Should I talk about the insecurity? I bet you talk about uh, where which one? So tell me, where they go use hold these people? Why would Nigeria want to reward failure? That is why I'm surprised that people actually voted for the ruling party. Why? Because uh -uh. a lot of this we complained about these things together. We complained. If you go to every corner in the market, in the office, in schools, you go to hear complain about this government. And then you want to tell me that after the after all those things we complain about, we came back. I was voted for the same people. Oh, God, no, now. Oh, God, first, if you like yourself and your party, you know they can't they talk this kind of thing. You could just close mouth because <laughs> if Nigerians really, really descend on Ona, what is all they talk? Eh? You could blame yourself, say, talk. All right, on this note, we have come to the end of the news. We say thank you for sending in to listen. Until I come, you'll be next time. Enjoy the rest of your day.